when with speed 40 meter per second blows parallel to the roof of the house you can see in the diagram it's almost parallel only assuming that the pressure inside the house is atmospheric pressure the pressure exerted by the wind on the roof in the direction of the the direction of the force will be so we have Bernoulli's equation so P plus rho gh plus half rho v square is going to be constant so this is for the up like the upper side of the roof and the same thing we have for the lower side of the roof okay so this is for upper side of the roof this is for the lower side of the roof now let us uh, go step by step so pressure at the up is going to be less so we write it p u because rho g h c the height difference from both the level of the roofs okay this height difference okay it's considered to be negligible because it's like you know the roof is thin only and uh, so therefore we have the pressure you know this h remains the same so therefore this and this is gone plus half rho v square so half into the velocity which is upper okay so rho air is 1.2 kg per meter cube and the velocity was 40 meter per second so this is uh, 40 into 40 meter square per second square this is equal to the pressure which is at the lower and half rho v square now the velocity inside the house is going to be zero so here the velocity is going to be zero on okay so we have plus zero so therefore clearly we have p l minus p u is equal to and let us do this so this is 0 0.6 okay um so this becomes meter square okay it's per second square actually because velocity square so uh, 40 into 40 so 1600 into 0 0.6 which is on gone 6 is 96 so 960 and this is uh, on on meter square newton per meter square so this is the pressure difference so therefore the force is going to be 960 newton per meter square into 250 meter square okay multiply by 4 divide by 4 so this is 1000 so this is 240 so this is 240 into 1000 so this is around 2.4 into 10 to the power 5 newton and since the pressure below is more because pl minus pu that's what we are getting so therefore the force will be in this direction and that will be upwards okay so therefore we write here so this is upwards and it's the option c okay so i'll just explain it again so here if we see then what what is happening is the we have to apply the bernoulli's theorem so this is the bernoulli's theorem p plus rho gh plus half rho v square this is constant now the pressure so here it is p upper here it is p lower now of course the uh, when we apply the formula we are able to see that uh, this height factor we are kind of neglecting because the height is almost same now this is the pressure which is on the upside like upwards of the roof this is the pressure on the lower side of the roof okay so pl minus pu that is lower side minus upper side this comes out to be 960 newton per meter square so we multiplied with 
the area because pressure equals force by area so force becomes pressure into area so therefore we get 2.4 into 10 power 5 newton up thank you